everyone, Edward here and welcome to Windows Report. And in this video I will show you what to do when Windows 11 is not recognizing USB devices. Before we start with showcasing a few solutions, please keep in mind that you can try plugging the storage drive into different USB ports to make sure it's not a hardware issue. Otherwise, let's just jump to the first solution and that is to disable the selective suspend option. To do this, press the Windows button, then type Edit Power Plan and select it from the search results. In here, click on Change Advanced Power Settings, which will open a new window called Power Options. Next, double-click USB Settings and afterwards click on USB Selective Suspend to open the setting that you can see. Make sure to select the Disabled option on the Setting drop-down menu, then press the Apply button on the Power Options window and OK to exit. Another useful solution is to change the power management settings for the USB root hubs. Right-click the Windows button and select the Device Manager option from the context list. In here, click on the View menu and select the Show Hidden Devices option on that menu. Now just double-click the Universal Serial Bus Controllers category and simply double-click a USB root hub listed there. In the following window, select the Power Management tab and make sure to uncheck the Allow this computer to turn off this device to save power checkbox to deselect that option. Now just click on OK to close the USB root hub window and you can also try to do the same procedure for all the USB root hubs listed. In here you can also update the drivers for the USB root and generic hubs simply by right-clicking the USB root hub and selecting the Update Driver option. Now you can just click on Search automatically for drivers in the Update Drivers window that opens. Make sure to try this procedure as well for all the other generic root hubs. You can also assign a drive letter to the USB device. To do this, make sure to plug the USB storage drive into your PC, then right-click the Windows button and select the Disk Management option from the context menu. In here, right-click the USB drive in Disk Management and select the Change Drive Letter and Paths option. Now click the Add button on the Change Drive Letter and Path window that opens and simply press the OK button to add the drive letter. Lastly, you can also reinstall drivers for the USB drive that isn't recognized. Make sure that your USB drive is inserted in your desktop or laptop, then right-click the Windows button and select Device Manager from the context list. In here, double-click Disk Drives to extend it and then right-click the problematic USB drive to select the Uninstall Device option. Afterwards, just unplug your USB device from the PC, wait about 1 or 2 minutes, then connect the USB drive with your PC again. And that's it! Plenty of options to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you!